Yesterday I saw a video, Education for Chris Duke by Devin Lorat, and it was hilarious. Bless his heart. It must have taken him a day, day and a half to get that video up because, as you guys know, all they got in Canada is dial-up internet connection. But I got to tell you, it was it was really funny. I reached out to him on Facebook. You know, we talked a little bit. I'd like to do an interview with him at some point. You know, he's just a really nice guy, and, you know, it, it really made me feel bad because, you know, when Big Frank devastates this guy, what, in like six, seven days from now, I just hope that all of you fans out there that have been so supportive of him on social media will continue to be supportive of him after the devastating loss in Buffalo. Because honestly, guys, I mean, you don't want to be fake fans. You know what I mean? You want to support someone when they're on top, as Devin will be for the next five or six days. And you also want to support someone when they've lost it all. You know what I mean? Because honestly... It's going to be a really sad trip for him going back to Canada. And, you know, the Tim Hortons isn't going to taste the same. You know what I mean? It's just not going to be the same. And I know that a lot of Canadians are getting real excited because, you know, there is the Tim Hortons thing that you guys do. But also, it's it's September, so in about a month or two, you're going to start chopping down all them Christmas trees and making money again. You know what I mean? And the economy is going to flourish. But honestly, guys, like, please, you know, I want you to be as supportive of Devin after the devastating loss as you have been leading up to this horrendous match that he decided to get himself into.